Hello, I'm Ilian St. Hilaire, and I'm showcasing my mesh at the Taught Leadership Day at Intel. So let's take a look at what we have. This is a big demo that I brought today. I have two PCs, I have a netbook, a laptop, I have two digital home setup boxes, I have uh, mid, you know, like, like small embedded devices, and I have a Microsoft home server. And what all these computers have in common, oh by the way, I have a router right here. And all these devices, what they have in common is that they run the small meshing agent. So very small uh, C code agent, it's very portable, runs on Linux, Windows, 32-bit, 64-bit. And all these computers or embedded devices are currently monitoring each other. So this picture here shows uh, the, this is a tool that looks at the current state of the mesh. And we see all the laptops, all the embedded devices, and this is a live picture. So if I disconnect one other device or I connect another device into the mesh, you'll see the, the mesh and all the links here update. Now, what can you do with this? Well, first of all, the agent is self-upgrading. If I upgrade an agent, all the computers that have the same architecture will also update within a few minutes. So it's, it's very uh, easy for me to dispatch new updates to the system. I just have to update it one or two machines, and it just spreads through on its own. So imagine all the usages and applications that you can just up, keep updating and have the update just spread you know, throughout your network automatically. Really kind of useful. The other thing we can do is now we can use the security and the certificates and all the stuff that, that we've built on top to build services. So you can discover new computers on your network very quickly because you can just watch the mesh. Uh, you can do, for example, power monitoring. This is a power monitoring application. And we can see that I'm using 100% a, a of my power here. And, and you can see when I started a demo and up to now it's mo still monitoring. So if I take a computer on, off, turn it on, turn it off uh, the, the network or off the power state, it will change colors here. Another thing we can do is manageability. You can find all the computers that have AMT, connect to them, and start doing management operations. Each agent has a command prompt. So this little command prompt here comes from the remote agent. So I can type help and uh, PS take a look at uh, processes and so on. So this is a management command prompt built into the agent, and you can basically, if you're an administrator, you can connect to any other computer, discover them using the mesh, connect to the agent, and start doing management operations. But probably, if this is not good enough, probably the number one thing that would be you know, that is awesome about this is that we can pick one of these nodes to be a leader have the node connect permanently to a web service. So in this poster, we have the mesh. This is the middleware. We have our mesh, our actual mesh, and one of these computers would be connected to a web service. So a, a server, a little like Google or you know Hotmail or whatever. But this service would now have a connection back to your network at all times. So I could go on the website and do things like wake up computers, manage them, access those pump, use the same tools, but also do out of band operations like uh, ID redirect on AMT, reboot a computer to BIOS, and change the settings, all these operations that normally you can only do on a local network, you can now do remote. And the reason why we can do that is because we can basically bounce off other mesh nodes to do those operations. Lots of different usages here that are um, available, I'm just skimming the surface, but the demo's about to start and we're going to see a lot of people uh, come in and enjoy this. Thank you very much.